Welcome into Three Legends Stadium here in Butte for the semifinals of the inaugural state baseball tournament here in Montana. And Grace, just two areas of the state present in this round, the Bitterroot and the Flathead area, something I don't think either of us saw coming. That's for sure. There's two championship tickets up for grabs. Let's get to those highlights. In the first game of the day, it's the one seed out of the West Polson and the one seed out of the Southwest, Florence Carlton. The Falcons strike right away, giving them a 1-0 lead going into the bottom of the first, but Polson comes back and gets one of their own to tie it up going into the second. Here's the senior Simeon Cawley from the Pirates with the score and later it's the Dawson Dumont hit with the senior Jarrett Wilson cashing in the run. The Pirates will hold on despite three runs scored for Florence Carlton late in the game and win 5-4 clinching in the top of the seventh. Dumont pitched for six innings and held the Falcons to seven hits. Here's what he had to say after the game. It's like unreal. It's kind of like a surreal experience honestly. Uh, I don't know. I'm kind of lost for words right now but feels good. Uh, it means more than anything. These, are, these guys are like my closest friends. Uh, I've been playing with them for like six or seven years. So I've known these guys for the rest of my life, or the whole my whole life, and it uh, feels good. All I was looking for is just to throw strikes so my infielders and outfielders can make plays. So I was just trying to get in the zone. All right, folks, now let's jump to our second semifinal between Hamilton and Whitefish to see who will meet Polson in Saturday's championship. Second inning, Whitefish up big 5-0, but Hamilton chipping away as this short shot from Toby DeMoss. Bats in, Vince Boz, and Hamilton gets on the board. But the Bronx hopes will be short-lived as third inning, a wild pitch will allow Logan Coons to slide home, and that's going to kick off a scoring spree for the Bulldogs. Same inning, and Maddox Moeller knocks this one into left field, and that'll send Josiah Ruther home to make it 7-3 Whitefish. And the onslaught continuing as Clayton Godsey bats in Jake McIntyre and now the Bulldogs up 9-3. Now Coons pouring it on and the Bulldogs have their seventh run in the third inning. Whitefish takes an insurmountable lead and here's Washington State commit Ty Schweiger notching the final out and that'll secure a five inning 14-3 win and set up a championship game between the Bulldogs and Pirates. I caught up with Schweiger after the game. It says a lot about our brotherhood on the team. It says a lot about how much we care about each other. Um, we've known each other since we were in kindergarten. All of us just love each other. We're all best friends. So having that in a team really creates a family environment. And I think that's the reason we're here. We just go out there, play a team game, and we're here. We're at the chipper. The inaugural state baseball tournament wraps up with the championship tomorrow right here at Three Legends Stadium. In Butte, for Luke Shelton, I'm Grace Lawrence, MTN Sports.